All right, so what we're doing here is we're we're strapping down a trailer. These are hurricane straps, and we're showing you the process of how to properly install them. And uh, he's just making sure it works right first. There we go. He's starting the bolt on the other side, but he's leaving enough slack in the nut to where he can still spin it. Now he's going to slide the strap through. There's a small slot in the bolt. Takes a second. There it goes. Now he's got the strap through it. And he's going to the other side. He's now hooking the strap on the edge of the beam on the outside. Now we come back to the bolt. It's making a mark where the pre tension's at. The double has to come back. So, what he's doing here is you want to be able to wrap the strap around. You don't want to cut it. We're just going to. Now he made the mark, so he's got his slack. Now he's going to put the wrench onto the bolt, and he's going to turn the bolt. And they might vary in sizes. This one that we're using here is, what do we got, 13 sixteenths or 15? 15 sixteenths. 15 sixteenths. Now he's got his tension, and it's wrapped around the proper way, as you can see. Double wrap. It's a double wrap and a pinch. And we have the mark. And we have the marks on the bolts, so you line it up with the grooves inside the notch. Now he's lined up right there. He's going to start tightening the backside, and what that does is it pulls it into place and locks it so that bolt can no longer turn. Starting to go in, you can see it kind of setting itself. There. Now you just seen the bolt seat itself. It's already in. It's all seated in, and then you just tighten the back side, and it seats it all the way. That will close the gap if you see the video. Now the gap's starting to 